Hello ho everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Trading Card Game. I was going to build a deck off screen and set up for something, but I realized that we have a tiny little event we can go ahead and take care of. A character that we spoke with when we first started, but we couldn't do anything with. <coughs> so, there's a guy here and I'm not going to talk to him yet because you, once you have the ability to trigger a scene, it's either do it then or never do it again. This guy is, wants energy cards. He tells you to come back to see him whenever you have a bunch of energy cards. He wants your energy cards. But, the game only checks A, how many energy cards you have in total, and B, it ignores, it doesn't make you give out of your deck. So, I have three decks that are literally nothing but 59 energy cards and a Pidgey. Um, so we do have some energy cards we're going to be losing, but it's only a minuscule amount compared to what he's designed to take from you. Uh, I have a deck, another deck, and a third deck. So, when you build lots of decks, you start to run out of energy cards. Please give me all your, your, your energy cards. Give me all the energy cards that aren't in your deck. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give all of them. And if you say no, he vanishes, never comes back. Uh, <clears throat> but if you say yes, you lost all the energy cards that weren't in your deck, which is like 10 cards for me. Wow, thanks. Since you were so nice, I'll tell you a secret. Check the wall, two tiles left of the bookcase. You'll probably find something really nice. Thanks again. Bye. And away he goes. And behind the painting here, we found a level 9 so slow poke. Now, I think that guy does come back at some point, maybe? I Possibly. I don't know. Um, so now we're going to go through and dismantle these decks so I can get my energy cards back. There we go. <clears throat> so. We have a few choices. Um... How about, well we can't do the fighting club as I mentioned, let's finish off this side. So let's hit the science club, shall we? And for the science club, well yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and diary save now. Um, for the science club, let's pull out, let's see here. Science is gonna be using poison and such as that, so let me see here. Uh... Yeah, that's what I thought. They're going to be using the ones that are weak to Psychic. They may actually have some uh, Grass Pokemon, so I'll have to be aware of that. Alakazam's okay, but I don't really care for Alakazam. I like Kadabra, though. We'll throw Alakazam in there, too. Sure, why not? Um, Slowbro's okay. Not that great. Oh, yeah, we can do Ghastly. Now, of course, Ghastly has no weakness, which is silly, because of course it has a weakness. Uh, so we'll have Gasoline Gengar. Hypno's good. So I think... Should we use Mewtwo? This isn't a very good Mewtwo, but I'll take it. And... Eh. <clears throat> Just like with uh, Psychic. Psychic and Psywave on those two cards is basically the same. I'll just take Mewtwo. Uh, and we'll take Jinx. That should be enough, so... Alright, so that's 23-ish energy. I doubt I'm going to need all of it, so we'll do 20. <clears throat> now let's throw in a good... I'm tempted to just throw in Persian, honestly. Uh, Lickitung is okay, not that great. Taurus is okay. Oh hey, I have a Dratini. Something to supplement... Oh, you know, do I don't have a chancy, do I? No, I do need something with a lot of HP. Yeah, Wigglytuff is good. You know what? Wigglytuff. In fact, we'll use Wigglytuff and this Jigglypuff, because they have the highest HP. Uh, and for Wigglytuff and Jigglypuff, I need six more energy. So we'll throw in a couple more and throw in the double colorless. 
All right. Bills. Uh, should be fine without energy search. Energy removal will be nice, though. I might need scoop up. Pokédex. Plus power. Maybe a defender. Yeah. That's what we're going with. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, take out the plus power and get potions. There we go. Possibly even a super potion. Hold up. Hold up, hold up. Yeah, let's remove one energy removal and grab a super potion. Because it costs one energy card, but can do four damage counters. So that'll help with uh, Al um, Alakazam's uh, Poke Power. That's what I'm going for, anyway. <coughs> and... Let's call this... I just thought of the, a name for this. Mind Games. I don't really have a reference here, so... Okay. Well, let's check out the the uh, secretary here, clerk, whatever. Greetings. Welcome to the science club. This club is for techniques who or technicians' techniques who love science. <laughs> the Pokemon cards used here are those with the powers of science. So there will likely be uh, psychics here as well, but just not as many. Specs. Your name is Specs, or they're just describing you because you're wearing spectacles, aka glasses. <coughs> I get so involved in the Pokemon trading card game, I lose track of time. Isn't the Pokemon trading card game really fun? I mean, yes. Um, Ishihara wants to trade the rare- oh! Whip. Let's check what card it is. Next year, because you heard the rumor, I was looking for a Clefable. Oh! I do have a Clefable. Hey hey! Promotional card, Surfing Pikachu. Yep, it's an electric type that uses water energy. You just splash it into a water deck, and it's actually quite helpful. Uh, 50 HP, it's not that great. It doesn't have an evolution. Um, but 30 damage for 2 energy is really good. And I couldn't use that Clefable anyway, so it's a good thing, uh, it's a good thing I went for Wigglytuff, huh? Please don't disturb me, I'm in the middle of a very important experiment. He's easy now, this will happen. Okay. I don't understand science, but I understand Pokemon cards. I lost. I'm sorry. Also, I love this symbol in the middle. Like, that's just so imposing. Okay. We research Pokemon cards here at the Science Club, especially science Pokemon cards. Science Pokemon are exceedingly strong. Would you like to duel against my Science Pokemon deck? Sure. <clears throat> we'll play with four prizes. Let's begin. Science Club member Eric. Poison deck. Alright. What do we get? Ooh, Jinx is a starter. Not bad. Uh-oh. No. Oh, no. Not coughing. Oh, you just finished the turn without attacking, did you? I think you're gonna have to do that again, my friend. Alright, so we only have double slap right now, but, uh, hey. Double slap. Okay, Drowsy can go down. I'm gonna get this. Uh, what is his, his foul gas? Oh, I was afraid of that. Okay, be prepared. What does Jinx's retreat cost too? Ouch, that's painful. <coughs> okay, I'm gonna pop the defender. Uh, just in case. I was afraid this was the foul gas one. Ah, missed. No, my double slap hit the the, what is it, like, 95 accuracy in base game? Or is it 85? I can't remember. Oh, he went to call Weezing. Oh, no. Well, that sucks. So, I have a choice. I can either deal with poison for a couple of turns and pray I get... Oh, hello, Wiggly Tough. You know what? We're staking him. We're just gonna blow him away. 
We should be able to take him out before I die. Hey, a super potion. You know, why didn't I include a full heal? Like, I knew I was going against poison types. Why in the world was I not using a full heal? Also, using the Weedle to let me die to poison damage. That is so mean. Okay. Um. Well, I got energy on, on her, so let's just do that. Now, he's not going to take... Yeah, he's only going to take 20 damage. Yeah, I won't survive another turn cycle. Not without using that super version. Like that. <laughs> hey, Ghastly. Hi, Arbok. Arbok's gonna kill me, isn't he? Terror Strike? Wait a minute. Actually, I kind of hoped you had done that. Wait a minute. Terror Strike. Yeah, I've never seen this Arbok before. At least I've never fought it for more than a second. Maybe I took it out too fast. Anyway, uh, okay, so let's place Ghastly. Let's use Bill. Abra and Kadabra. Or Abra. I already have Kadabra. Uh, let's place Abra. I need more energy now. Okay. Meditate won't kill it. But I think uh, Jinx is going down this uh, this turn unless Terror Strike kicks me out of the room. He actually would save Jinx if that happened. Yup. Thank you. You saved Jinx. <clears throat> Another Cadaver. I don't need these Cadavers. And they only take one energy, so Double Colorless isn't very helpful for for me, for Drowsy either. Well, let's just pound him. Ah, oh, Psychic Energy, nice. Horn Hazard. Another Psychic Energy, okay, now we're getting somewhere. Uh, do I give it to Ghastly or do I give it to Abra? I'm gonna give it to Abra. I do have two cadavers. And technically, if I don't get another psychic energy, I can equip the double colorless because so, uh, Super Psy only requires any energy there. Not that I'm going to need it, but. Your horn hazard failed again. Sorry, Dinaran. You have fallen. Oh, hello, Hypno. I can't believe my science Pokemon deck could lose. Anything new? Not really. Oh, Pokemon Breeder. Okay, that's a good card to have. Put a two, stage 2 evolution card from your hand on the matching basic Pokemon. You only let play this card when you'd be allowed to evolve that Pokemon anyway. Basically, you can skip stage 1. You go from basic to stage 2 immediately. Uh, it's not a bad not a bad card at all. You just have to make sure you have enough energy to handle that, that uh, evolution. <clears throat> I must research this card. It's not quite working right. Uh, oh, this? It's a machine that makes stacks. It's much better than Dr. Mason's. Let's see here. Do you want to duel against me? Shall we begin the match? It will be a single match of four prizes. Science Club member David. Lovely Nidoran. Uh oh. He's gonna be a Nita Queen, Nita King user. Well, you know, I'm not going to argue with having Jinx right off the bat. And an energy removal. Huh. This is such a mean deck. Uh oh, wait a minute. Okay, no, it's a duo, so it shouldn't. 
resist. I think they resist fighting, actually. Okay, now this part's gonna be a little annoying. I would like... Okay, what did he put that energy on? Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, I need one more energy. The duo, okay. The duo's fury attack. Ha! Ah, feel my pain. Ah, good. Here we go. And I'm actually going to remove Nidoran's energy. Meditate won't take it out, but it will almost take it out. <clears throat> yes, waste your energy. I'm not bitter about that. Not at all. Oh, hey, another Jinx. Uh, I'll place it. Not really much of a point, but... Alright, meditate it out. Good, more psychic energy. I start adding that to hello. Aww. Stop calling your boyfriend. I'm gonna get the other Jinx ready because I think I might end up losing this Jinx if I get bad bad dice rolls, dice rolls, coin flips. <clears throat> I could scoop up, but then I lose all the energy. But it does prevent him from getting a uh, a prize. So. I think I'm going to risk it and go for Meditate, but if I land at... Oh, hey. Yeah, let's get rid of Grimer's energy, because this thing is about to die. And I'm going to go ahead and put that energy on that Jinx. Okay, good, I'll survive. Oh, now that eternal question. Do I let Jinx go down? <clears throat> I think I scoop it up. Because I can switch to that Jinx. <laughs> no prize for you, jerk. So mean. <laughs> no, not nasty goo. Aw. Uh. Ooh. Ooh. Well, I guess I know who I'm evolving. And I actually want him for his power, so. That's why you did that. Might have a problem here. So, at this point in time, I may not have a choice but to... Uh, <coughs> get Gengar out here and kill Nidoran with Dark Mind. <laughs> Thank you. 
I do know that Meowth only has Payday, though, so I should be okay. Because, see, Dark Mind won't kill Meowth. Won't even damage Meowth. But that's okay, because I can damage uh, Nidoran with, with uh, that move. And Payday is only going to do 10 damage, so... We're still okay. A little concerned, but okay. I'm also going to start giving some energy to him. Just in case I get Alexam. Oh, sure. I'll, I'll use Bill. Oh, a potion. Thank you. It was perfect timing. Alright, let's get Abra fully energized, ready to go. Now, if I wanted to, I could change the damage to another Pokemon. I could even take out Meowth by pulling over the damage I'm giving to Nidoran over to Meowth. But this is simpler. Just knock out whoever has the least amount of HP. Now, that being said, if he evolved Nidoran, then I would definitely go into that operation where I started moving it to Meowth. <clears throat> but in this particular case, I can knock out Nidoran without ever touching it. And hello, Mewtwo. My theory is the machine's malfunctioning caused it. Your theory is wrong, sir. I don't think I got anything new that time. But more copies of what I have is never a bad thing. Omastar. Ooh, Omastar. I think I had Omastar. And another copy of uh, Raichu. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, what's with my throat today? I've got to fix this machine. Okay, well, you do that. I'm going to talk to this guy. Hey, you. Rick and the Clubmaster is in the middle of an important experiment. He has no time to see if someone like you. Or see someone like you. If you really want to see him, you must defeat me first. Not too smart, if you got, but you got nerves. We'll play for four prizes. If you win one match, I'll let you through. Science Club member, Joseph. Flyin Pokemon deck. Oh, flyin', huh? Okay, so you're gonna use colorless then, I'm sure. I could be in some danger here. I had no basic Pokemon, okay. So far, this deck's doing pretty good, though. Oh boy, starting with a guess. Oh, Jinx! Yay! Oh, Mewtwo, even. Let's do Jinx. Because Mewtwo requires two energy. At least I can get an attack off. And it, uh, Jinx has enough HP to survive. So we'll start with Jinx and put Mewtwo on the bench. Wow. Okay, starting with... I guess I'm putting Ghastly up front now. Oh, well. Okay, what have we got coming? Another Ghastly, a double colorless. Let's get the potion and then the energy. And Ghastly's not gonna matter too much. A Spiro. I mean, I can just swap to Jinx. start putting more energy on Jinx, so Jinx can use, uh, Meditate. And I'll potion, well, I'll save the potion for Ghastly, because he only has 5 HP. Just getting no luck when it comes to, uh, Link's Paralyze. Alright, so I'm gonna heal Ghastly. Energy on uh, Jinx. And now meditate and take this thing out. And 
And another potion. Nice. So I might be able to heal Jinx too. So long as the spirit doesn't take me. Okay. I was like, so long as the spirit doesn't take me out somehow. Which would not surprise me. It's uh these these things can be dangerous. Alright, so let's start putting energy on Mewtwo. And Yeah, let's go ahead and heal Jinx. So the next turn, I should be able to take out Spiro. Oh, hello, Zubat. Why does he have electric energy? Does he have Zapdos? Okay, and that's the last of my uh, Pokédex use. So the rest are things I don't know. Oh, hello, Hypno. Good of you to join me. Okay, this is Leech Life. All right. Give that to Gasoline. Sorry, Zubat. Double colorless. Don't really need it right now. I have not drawn Jigglypuff, so. Not that it's going to matter, but I'm a jerk. So yeah, I like this deck. This deck is uh, very efficient. Jinx is fantastic. Like, there's gonna be a time I'm gonna get stuck with like Ghastly and only Ghastly or Abra and only Abra. But hey, I lost. Ugh, since I promised, I have to let you through and take this laboratory. As surprising nobody, the science people, like final science person, gave me a laboratory. See anything new off the top of my head? Rick's in the middle of experiments. So don't bother him too much. Well, hello, Rick. How are we doing today? I'm Rick, master of the science club. Science rules nature. That's why it's so strong. Do you wish to test the strengths of science by pay playing against me? All right, six prizes. Let us begin. Science club master Rick, wonders of science deck. Oh boy. The nastiness of poison deck, I think, is more more apt. Oh hey, look what I what I said about uh having Abra and Gasling. That's fine though. Uh you know I have Gengar, so I'm actually gonna play Abra first. Normally I would do it the other way around, but We're gonna go ahead and play Bill as well before we do anything. Jinx. Oh, that's the foul gas coughing. Oh, no. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to let Abra sit here for a minute. I know that that coughing can't do anything without... Uh, without two energies. <clears throat> oh, no. Never mind. I'm sorry, Abra, you did. You very did. That's fine, though. Jeez can come out and finish this. I have a potion if need be. This is like the perfect starting for Jinx. Let's go meditate. Ah, uh, crap. I mean, we knew it was going to happen. We knew Jinx was going to get poisoned here. I'll use the potion and just keep Jinx up as long as I can. Another potion. Nice. Keep Jinx up as long as I can. Let's go ahead and give energy to... Ghastly has a chance of paralysis, so I'm going to go with Ghastly. And then I draw a hit now. Why did I have a feeling it was gonna be hit now? Oh no, not foul gas. Don't. That's actually worse game. That's not a good thing. 
Because now I'm poisoned and confused. This is actually the worst case scenario. Now I need to get somebody else up and ready to go because... Okay, at least I got Meditate off. I mean, I'm dead on my next, or after my next turn anyway. Oh, hello Mewtwo, that's a special Mewtwo. That's actually a better Mewtwo, if I'm not mistaken. I might be mistaken. Yep, there we go. Sorry, Jinx, you did well. Alright. Let's use Ghastly. Pokedex, good, thank you. Nothing but energy. Well, you know what? I like it to... No, stop. I like it in the order it's in. Alright, so... I know in a couple turns I'll be able to use that, so I'm just going to go straight for it. What is this? Ah, right. It's actually a way I can recover lost energy. It's not a bad deal. If uh, Ghastly survives long enough, maybe. Oh, look, I paralyzed him when I was getting knocked out. Hello, Mewtwo. Is this the one that has... Oh, yeah, Energy Absorption, which takes two energy cards from your discard pile, adds, adds to Mewtwo, and he has Cyber. Uh... I don't know... I don't know if I would call it better, but it's most definitely... Uh, dangerous. I'll take a paralysis. Oh, I bet he has grass energy in his... in his uh, graveyard, in his uh, discard pile. What is Gastly's retreat? Retreat cost is zero. Let's do this. Hello, Hypno. Now, before you ask, well, that makes no sense. How in the world is, is Mewtwo weak to Psychic? Because Ghost and Psychic are both the same symbol, so... And Porygon, you can change your resistance, buddy, but what is that really going to do for you, aside from stall? Maybe that's it. Maybe he just wants to stall me. I have no bench Pokemon to hit, so I'm just gonna wait. I guess I can boost one of these Ghastlies. Sir, the moment you place anything else down, I'm gonna start attacking it. You know this, right? Hello, Grimer. Oh, I forgot I could use Prophecy. <coughs> now, the funny part is, if I can get Gengar, I can knock out Porygon using, uh, Gengar. Yeah, maintenance is an interesting card. Oh. You know, that is a more dangerous card than that Grimer. I really hope I get a Haunter soon.
curious. How much energy does he, do you need? Only, okay, yeah. Yeah, our tree cost is too up, not bothering. Oh, look, a cadaver. Stall, my friend. This is your fault. This is why I like Dark Mind. I think Grimer has what? One more hit? Yep. Well, I'm um, guess I'm just gonna give energy to that uh, Ghastly and knock out Grimer. Now, with Grand Grimer now knocked out, let's do the wave, shall we? Probably could have done that a lot faster, but I didn't want to lose him now and his dark mind power. There are at times problems even science can't answer. Here, take this medal. It is a result of our research. Oh, that was the next one. <laughs> okay, that works. And let me give you this. Please, add this to your collection. Magneton. Wait, which one? Yes, yeah, self-destruct one. Wait, that's a different self-destruct one. This one has still on Sonic Boom. That's not the one I had earlier, I don't think. Or is it? No, because the one I had earlier didn't have Sonic Boom. It had, um, Thunder Wave. Legendary cards are but a legend. Science is the only truth. I must continue my research of science Pokemon. And he goes back to whatever he was doing. Uh, I... Is there another... This is four, I think it is. Uh, just to be safe, I'm gonna switch to my burn deck. Okay, we're good. <sighs> Alright, so let's go here. There's a person here, I'll talk to him in a second. Greetings, welcome to the Psychic Club. This club for people who use Psychic Pokemon. Psychic Pokemon are difficult to use, but they're very strong. What? You also want the Legendary Pokemon cards? I want them too, but I'm not quite good enough. Oh. Well, we're doing this now. Hi, Hellblades. So you finally came this far. I've already won five medals. By the time you win your eighth medal, I'll have headed to the Legendary Pokemon cards. I'll catch you later. See ya. <laughs> okay. I dropped all my cards, so I'll put them in order here. Hi, I'm Robert. I'm a member of the Psychic Club. My ghost deck is really strong. It doesn't have any weaknesses. It's difficult for Pokemon opponents' call attacks to cause damage. Would you like to duel with me? Well, technically you're right, but also technically you're wrong. Let's duel him. 
A single match with four prizes. Come on, my precious ghosts. Let's make his Pokemon disappear. Well, that's got dark quick. Psychic Club member, Robert. Ghost Dad. Okay, between these, I'll use Drowsy. Get Abra out there. Okay, he drew a potion. Now see, he says it's difficult to cause damage, but that's just because he has no weakness and resists fighting. I'm not using fighting Pokemon because that would be silly for me to do. Because it's a psychic gem. Club, whatever. Oh, hello, Alexam. Where were you all of last game? Not that it would have helped, but I would have liked to have you. Hey, I confused Gasling. That seems, uh, fitting or ironic. Aw, he evolved. He literally evolved it to get rid of the confusion. That's silly. I mean, it's smart, but it's also silly. Alright, it's fixing you this hypnosis. Ugh. Well, Drowsy's still asleep. That's not good. That is very not good. He had no more psychic energy. Okay. I would like to wake up, please. Jeez, how many Professor Oaks are you going to use? Oh no. Well, <coughs> Drowsy's dead. Is he getting back Professor Oak? Oh no, he recycled Ghastly apparently. Actually, no, I'm not going to do that yet. I want to wait until I need to because I can use Scoop Up to get Ghastly safe if need be. He's preparing for Gengar too. It has three energies on uh, Haunter. So if I get Hypnosis, and if I'm still asleep, then I scoop up Ghastly, uh, place Ghastly back down, put energy on him, and use Abra's zero retreat cost to get back out. Nope, didn't have to. Okay. Oh, hey, Jigglypuff. Nice. Let's go ahead and put some energy on Jigglypuff, too. Ooh, Kadabra. Alright, let's start working on getting that Alakazam. Another Jigglypuff. I might be able to actually use uh, what's it called? The damage swap tactics.
those gas is Richie. Also zero. Right. So if you go to the Pokemon power menu, you can select the Pokemon to use their power. And repeat steps one and two, and then press B button at the end. You cannot move a counter if it will knock out the Pokemon. So I'm just going to take that off and give, well, let's give it to this Jigglypuff. Ah. Yeah, that's the better Haunter, I think. Whenever an attack does nothing, anything to Haunter, flip a coin if heads prevent all effects of that attack, including damage done to Haunter. I'll look at that Haunter specifically in a moment, but... counters together first and then I can remove them with a potion. If I can confuse him, he may be stupid enough to try to attack. That's a bad thing for you to do. That was a very bad thing for you to do. You were safer. Uh, just to protect myself. Should have stayed ditto, my friend. Should have stayed ditto. Oh, hey, look, Haunter. Oh, I forgot to look at what that Haunter can do. Nightmare, yeah. So it's it's nightmare is hypnosis, but it does damage. Now I can't use my Pokemon power while I'm asleep, so I have to be awake to use damage swap. Like, that Haunter has less HP, but it's far more dangerous in the long run. Awesome. We not only hit him, we also confused him. Nope. You can't go nowhere. You're not saving that, Haunter. That, ooh, wow. He just got some really bad luck. He got, like, what, three tails in a row? <laughs> oh, seriously, Meowth. Okay, fine. I'll use this Julie buff. Oh, how am I gonna? I don't have the ability to retreat, do I? Uh, I mean, I can, but it's gonna be expensive. Uh, pound. Yeah, all three of my energies. That's gonna suck. Oh well. That was the wrong Julie buff. Well, lost my free healing for my meat shield because of that, but eh, uh, it'll work, I guess.
Another scoop up, that's good. Oh, I didn't need it. Yay! That could have gone so much more horrible. How come a ghost deck lose? I was speaking of ghosts. Another Gengar, not gonna argue with that. And another Gengar. Oh, you want me to use Gengar? I'm already using Gengar. I won't lose next time. Stool again. Nah, I'm good. Legendary Pokemon cards are the ultimate cards. Everyone wants to inherit the legendary cards. That's why I play against so many different people. I just lost the duel, so I can't play right now. I don't like people who think too highly of themselves. That's why I never don't like members of the Psychic Club. I wish I could knock them off their high horses. Would you try to defeat Murray, the Psychic Club Master? If you defeat Murray, I'll give you something really valuable. Yes. Good, I'll be waiting here for you. I mean, I have to planning. I was planning on beating him anyway, but. Ah, yes. Another peaceful area, huh? Well, let's start. You've won quite a few medals. Okay, let's duel. But I see the future. You will lose. Yeah, if you come here early, these guys won't, like, will refuse to battle you. Okay, single match with four prizes. Here we go. Psychic Club member Stephanie. Strange power deck. I like that, uh, portrait art. I'm gonna go drowsy. Oh, Mr. Mime. Right, so Mr. Mime is interesting. You have to do less than 30 damage uh, in order to do any damage to him. And he has Meditate. Oh, Mr. Mime's actually a good card. <laughs> like, he only has 40 HP, but in it, they have to do 10 or 20 damage to take him out. They can't hit him with, you know, 100 damage. Uh, he can be a great stall here card if it's not early game. Sadly, early game, he's kind of just sits there and dies. I realized I had Confuse Ray, so... The Confuse Ray will still hit Mr. Mime, because it only does 10 damage still. But see, I couldn't use Dark Mind on him, but hello, speaking of Dark Mind. Okay, I need, uh... I need Ghastly to show up. Like, quickly. Hi, Hypno. Oh, no. Hello, Dark Mind. That is not good. I'm gonna have to go Abra. Crap. Paralysis failed. How dare you? Can't scoop up your only Pokemon. Neutralizing shield prevents all damage uh, of attacks, including or prevents all effects of attacks, including damage done to Mew by evolved Pokemon, excluding your own. The 
anti-evolved Pokemon card. That's what, kind of what Mew is, though. Like, Mew, even the other version of Mew, is designed to stop evolutions. Uh-oh. Now, if he does not think... If he thinks I'm not going to go ahead and put him immediately back to sleep, he's silly. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. I'm about to eat a dark mine. There's nothing I can do about it. Oh, wait. Oh. Well, as long as I have Hypno here staring at me in the face, I can't really afford to use any other uh, Pokemon because Dark Mind is just going to take me out. So I guess I keep punching. I mean, I understand that, uh, oh, great energy retrieval. Sleep is probably su superficial at this point. Oh, come on. <sighs> okay, ghastly. Good, we're getting somewhere. I need to save this Jigglypuff for that Mew. Or, well, no, because I don't know if Dark, Dark Mind won't be able to damage Mew, will it? I may end up having to scoop up this Jigglypuff, though, to save it. Let's see. I can do it that way. I have an in, technically. So, what is this? Can this look at something? No, it does supersonic. Okay. Unless he does a plus power, you can't take me out. Another Hypno? Really? Oh, that is not good. I only need to KO two Pokemon, but so does he. Yeah, Gengar would die in two hits easy. Okay, I'm gonna give it a chance. If I either I'm gonna be able to save Jigglypuff on the next turn, or I'm gonna lose it. It looks like I'm gonna be able to save it.
That's what I thought. I had to test that. So I can't use that, right? Yeah, the sleep confused your people are paralyzed. Your Mew, you, you Mew, your Mew lives one more turn. You know what? Hold up. Instead of using the power from that Lickitung. I can only use it once, right? Alright. I wish I could have damaged uh, Lickitung a little bit more, but... Eh, it'll be okay. And I've put Hypno back where he was. Uh, speaking of Hypno. Wait, there's nothing I can... Yeah, there's, no, there's nothing I can curse. We'll just win the battle here. Dark Mind wins us again. I'm a little mad that that was a ghastly. I can't believe my prediction was wrong. And we got another booster. Let's see. I don't recognize anything new. See a vision. You're dueling me again. Not anytime soon, I'm not. Remember, you finally came up with a, strong, a new strategy. This is a very good move. So I'll probably duel you now. By the way, would you duel me? Psychic Club member Daniel. Nap time now. Well, I'm prepared to have a lot of sleeping Pokemon because apparently we're going to be hit with Dream Unit. Okay, Jinx is not a bad starter. Ah, scratch. How about, nah, I'm good. You can't have that. Really? Ugh. Four tails in a row, that makes me so sad. Scratch does 20, yeah, that's what I thought. get hit by a scratch here, but... Or he could waste his turn and not do damage. I mean, who am I to judge? I know he's designed to power up Ghastly, but that Ghastly is terrible. Like, that's actually the worst Ghastly in the world. At least I got cured. I was about to say, don't do Destiny Bond now, because I'm not attacking you if you do. <laughs> okay, there's Drowsy. Did I draw hit? No, I did draw hit now. I thought so. 
I might have this in the bag. Really depends on what he does with that Paris. Hey, a Wigglypuff. Puff. Oh no, not sl oh, you move Scratch. Why didn't you use Stun Spore or Sleep Spore or Spore, whatever it is. Just because I'm a jerk like that. Dark Mind. Mwahaha. If you're ordinary player, you're no ordinary player if you can defeat me. Wow, I stumbled all over that sentence. Excuse me. Oh, that yawn hit me out of nowhere. Next time we play, I'm gonna win. Eh. Hi, I'm Nerf, master of the Psychic Club. You're the one who's visiting the clubs and win the medals. How do I know this? Because I'm psychic. Okay, let me test my new card strategy against your deck. Are you ready? Can you duel me for six prizes? Shall we start then? Psychic Club Master Murray, Strange Psy Shock deck. Also, the screw in his portrait and some sort of mystic symbol behind him or something? I don't know. Looks like he's about to throw custard in my face or something. Oh wow, I started with Wigglytuff. And a double color rest up. You know? You know? Let's just uh, start with that strategy. Don't mind if I do, game. I'm not going to do, uh, how many, he only has one Mr. Mime, okay. So, I'm not going to, to evolve just yet. Let's do the wave! Oh no. Hello, Chansey! Yeah, see, he does the damage swap uh, strategies. Also, we have Haunters, so let's boost this Gaxley. I was kind of hoping for another basic Pokemon. I want to boost through the wave. You know, this is actually my first time using Do the Wave. This is kind of mean. Oh, you know what's even better? So, this Chansey is apt to survive. Uh, oh no. Oh no, whatever shall I do? I can't do the wave anymore. Wow. Okay. Well, you know, I'm just gonna. They were fine in the order they were in. That's fine. Oh no. Whatever shall I do? So I can either take it out, uh, and then one shot the Abra's, or I can start cursing some of the Abra power here and let the Chansey other give the Chansey another shot. You know. Yeah, no, I think I'm going to do that, just because I don't want to have over damage on this uh, Chansey, or on the Abras over there. Yeah. 
Uh, that was unexpected, but okay. Good use of Pokemon Center, I suppose. I didn't make him delete the energy off that Abra. <laughs> that was an unexpected side effect. I I can't say that I've ever seen the computer use a Pokemon Center like that. I, I may have, but I don't remember. So we're just going to start moving energies early, or moving counters early then. Ooh, King is gone. Well, I know who he's sending out, that's for sure. So I'll be able to knock out both Abra and Chansey in a single blow. Or not. I'm still knocking out that Abra. You're not saving that Abra. <laughs> Guess I just start moving counters onto the other Abra now. Abra's dangerous enough that I don't feel bad doing that. Although. I'm gonna pull off Chansey. Because I can knock out Kangaskhan here. And Kangaskhan, in my honest opinion, is more dangerous than, uh. Chansey. Uh oh. That is not good. I mean, it was have to happen eventually. Okay, there's no space on the bench. So my power is maxed. Uh, and I have a cadaver myself. Oh no, I've taken 20 damage. I'm not going to go that far. I have a regular potion. We'll be fine. I sprayed away my Wigglytuff's boo boo. Let's just dance him away. Can't believe I just beat Murray with a freaking Wigglytuff. <laughs> that was awesome. Huh? I lost. Uh, well, you must be pretty good if you try to with the major Pokemon cards. Here, take the psychic. That was not the next one. Darn. Oh well. Here, take this laboratory booster pack. Also makes sense for him to give me that. There's anything. Oh, wait. Ooh. Uh, might have to transfer that over. I'll think of a new strategy. So come see me again. I'll be waiting. <laughs> yeah, real quick, we're going to modify mind games one second, switch haunters. Because that haunter is uh, better by far. You know, using both is still. Wait. Hang on. I'm going to see. Safe. I was afraid of that. Hi, Hellblades. Got any better? I've already won the sixth medal. I'll see how much better you've gotten. If you win, I'll give you another rare card. Come on, let's do it. Ronald. Powerful Ronald. Deck. I thought that was going to happen. There's a reason I saved it. I forgot to switch to burn, but we'll be okay. This deck is decent enough. Okay, I'm going to use Jigglypuff to start with because I have Scoop Up ready. Puff, don't fail me now. Another Puff, nice. Okay, he has... He, he, 
has a hard deck, honestly. Very well-rounded, but not... It's hard to have well-rounded well teams in the trading card game. Because they often end up being unable to do anything. So, he has the next best thing, which is a balanced, uh, multicolor deck. I'm just gonna go for the pound. If I go for Lullaby, he could immediately wake up and then hit me with Thundershock, so one way or another, he, there's a good chance I'm just gonna get hit here. Okay, he did more than 30 damage. That's not good. 40 damage. Yeah. Alright, let's see what Bill gives me. Did I get a potion? No, I didn't. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna lose Jigglypuff if I don't use this. Let's go to Ghastly, put Jigglypuff back down. Abra, I have to be careful with Abra. Alright, so I'm gonna use the zero retreat cost to switch to- oh no no, the wrong button. Switch to Jigglypuff, I have already used energy, so pound! Like to buzz down. Oh no, not like it's on. Okay, I don't have another, another, uh, scoop up, so... I will take Bill. Drowsy, okay. I only have energy in my hand, so nothing really happening here. We will put it on Drowsy. Go for pound. Pound for pound. That's terrible. Why would I even think that? Oh no, the scoop up. Okay, good. That's fantastic. So as long as it doesn't use a plus power, I'm okay. I mean, I lose the psychic energy that's attached to Newly Buff, but eh. Haunter, very good. I'm actually going to wait, because Ghastly having A, no retreat cost, and B, only needing one energy to attack is actually better in this particular case. Now, had that been the other, the new Haunter, I would be seeing a different change. Okay. <clears throat> so the question is, do I go ahead and use Scoop Up now, or do I give it a turn and risk him using a plus power? I think I'm going to risk him using a plus power. Up left to yes, left to. Okay. I'm going to give him an extra turn here. So I can soak up some more damage. And there's the plus power. <sighs> I knew he was going to use it. I just knew it. Oh well. Just realized this guy is resistant to psychic, isn't he? Shoot. Okay, I should have put more energy on this Jiggly buff. Okay, that's fine, he woke up. Nothing that was not expected. Okay. Ah! Oh, that's not good. You know...
Okay, so you just prevented me from using these ray. That's not that big of a deal. Plus... I don't want him being able to retreat for free. Like, I think if he had... I think Ripkin only has a one retreat cost, right? Also, I saw a Taurus back there. Yeah, there he is. And that's the thing, he has a lot of colors for Pokemon. So the Psychic deck is really bad to fight him with. When does Jigglypuff have the same amount of HP as Taurus? Dang it. He's gonna take me out in two turns. There's no way around it. Unless... Still taking me out, though. The defender did not save me. Oh, this is annoying. Alright, I don't have a choice. I'm gonna have to. Hello, Gengar. You come at a weird time. I cured his confusion with sleep, but I didn't realize it was going to happen. Well, everything is terrible now. Again, what, what is with this? At this point, I'm just feeding him uh, Abra's because I'm not getting any other opportunity. I mean, what other opportunity is there for me to have? He took out both my Jigglypuffs, so... No point in me attacking. Oh look, Taurus took itself out. He has far too many colorless Pokemon, and I do not have the power to fight them. And I am not getting anything to fight them with anyway. Because I have no energy. I have basically burned up all my energy at this point. G 
see. I want to order them. They're going to be out. Well, hello, Abra. You're not even half as good as I am. There's no way I'll be able to inherit the legendary Pokemon cards. Why don't you just give up? See ya! <laughs> so yeah. When we come back, we're going to kick his butt with some fire. We'll burn him to the ground. And then we'll probably go after the next club, obviously, because I have no idea what that's going to be. I guess I can step out. I'm just not going to save. Uh, so we've completed all the clubs on this side of this, the field. So we have three more. The Rock, Lightning, and Fighting Clubs. Um, I guess I technically could fit the, uh, to be the Fighting Club because the other members are kind of scattered around, but I think I have to talk to Cleaver first. Before they appear. But, I don't remember exactly. Anyway. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do, because, uh, we, we have to get some vengeance on that guy. Plus, I want his card. And until then, we hope to see you again. Later!